Hello everyone, how's everything? Today, I wanna to show you how you can create an event registration form and you can use this video to create any registration form for your events, conference, exhibition, or whatever usage in which you want, to, you want your um, audience to register. So to get started, just get to formalu.com, get to dashboard, and here you can start from scratch or get to the templates. And in the templates, you can get to the events and exhibitions section. And you can select from these or just uh, search for registration. So here uh, are various registration form templates. You can use any of them. And all of them are amazing. I'll just uh, show you how it works. This is the demo of it. It's perfect. I'll pick it. And here I can edit my form. I'll uh, edit the title. Here you can change the text, the date and time of your event. You can click on this part, add a screenshot of the map and change its link to your uh, map location. And uh, you can change the ticket prices in this table. Just It's just showing this. And here uh, is your form um, fields. Uh, by clicking on them, you can change their text and, and change if they're required or not. You can delete a field from here or duplicate and edit it and etc. So here are the basic uh, registration fields. And uh, here's a section field in which you will show uh, that um, here comes the ticketing uh, to the audience. So they know the prices, you they can uh, check it out again. And after that, we will show the audience uh, the ticket types so they can choose it from a drop down menu uh, or you can just get to the add field tab and add another um, field like multi choice so um, you will add you if you want to add your uh, tickets in a multi choice uh, view so uh, here are my tickets uh, I have early bird standard and VIP as you see in the above field and uh, here is the discount code so uh, I want to give discount to some of my audience so um, here is just a text I'm showing you can just delete it after submission it is displayed after submission and uh, here is the button to um, submitting the form. You can just edit it uh, as you wish. So I'll save my form and here's the link to my form. I click on go to the form and this is how it works. You can uh, change the view of it uh, from multi-step to single step just like this and save it. And I'll get, get back to my form tab and show, show you how it works. Here is my form or you can just um, change it back to multi-step. Uh, this is as easy as that. So uh, if you want to share the form with your audience, you can just copy the link to the form and share it with your audience or put it in your website. Uh, or if you want to embed your form into your website, here's the link to it. How can I use my form? And here are various types like script, iframe. It will give you a small piece of code which you can copy and put into your website. So this is how your form will look like in a website. Yeah, so, and also you can change the background and colors and everything. Um, there are various, um, settings for your form which you can change. Uh, this is how it works and uh, now let's say I want to change the prices. I, uh, I want to say like um, the early bird I uh, should be like $80. I'll change it also in this section field. I'll make it $80 and um, yeah so um, this form has a calculation, of course. I'll get back to my dashboard. It just asks me to make sure that my form is saved. Uh, here is my form in my dashboard. 
in the menu of it, uh, there is a calculator option. And by clicking on it, I'll uh, view my form in a calculation mode. And by clicking on each field, I will see its calculation. Here is the ticket type field, and you'll see that uh, the VIP adds, uh, if, if the user selects VIP, um, system automatically adds $1,000 to the price. And here you can see the unit, uh, the currency, which is USD. And, um, so uh, if it's standard, it adds $500 to the price. If it's Erlberg, it's, I want to change it to 80. So uh, it adds uh, $80 to the price. And I'll save it. And um, my calculation is saved. In a discount mode, uh, I want to show you how this count uh, how this count works. Uh, I'll say uh, if the answer was Elbert tickets, Elbert student, this is the code I will share, I have shared with my audience. So with my student audience actually, so that uh, they can put it into this field and get like $80 um, discount on the ticket. And uh, if I say, for example, subtract um, $75 from the students. Oh, here is, let's see, I have a test, 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 from me. Um, I'll say early bird with the same ticket. Oh, let's copy it again discount code and let's pay. And here you'll see that it's asking me to pay for $5. So I've completed my payment and here is uh, the receipt that's shown to me. And here is a QR code. I can scan it anywhere in the event. You can uh, have it uh, have a QR scanner code to make sure that uh, all payments are, all attendees have done the payment and have receive their ticket, they can print it and everything. So um, also you can see uh, the payment information in your dashboard just um, right here by clicking on the form uh, and in the responses tab, you will see the detailed information of the payment and everything. I hope it was helpful for you. It was this simple to create a registration form and everything was created for you in the templates and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, just comment down below. Hope you have a great event.